Hello right, everyone, welcome. And quick, this might not mean anything to you, right? And this is just going to make the fucking video longer than it needs to be, uh, which I hate doing. But th this is going to be nothing to you, um, except from Jacob, right? He's the real MVP. Now, Dead Rising 2 is being remastered. Not only Dead Rising 2, Dead Rising 2 off the record, and Dead Rising. And if you didn't know, I had this other channel called Curing the Gaming Puff. It's it says it says poof, but it I I assure you it's it's puff. Like as if you don't know what puff means, it 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 used to be like a fucking like a, a word you would use to basically say you're weak, you know, like you know something like that, like you're you're a puff or or called gay, um, you know, it's basically like that, like you're you're a fucking pansy, you know, like a fucking like Madagascar. They are just. A bunch of pansies. So yeah, and I, I had a fucking let's play on there, and I done two episodes, and I was just like, you know, this isn't gonna work, <laughs> because uh, although I was a retard, I still am. I knew that constant this fucking in the background, and like just the fucking laptop making noise, it's not gonna work, and also the fucking camera, and it's just shit. So if you haven't seen any of it, which I doubt you have, um, then have a look. I watched um. Cares how allegedly BT, or I say that kind of weird, like tongue twist, but what? Oh. Um, and he's finally in Division One. Hooray for him. Seems like me and Kanye West have something in common. I'm just extremely happy. Can you tell by my face? We both love to show our enthusiasm. I was raping. I was raping. I was raping. Holy shit, guys. I can't believe what I've just heard my squeaky self say. On behalf of my generation and generations to come. I am sincerely sorry for what you have just heard. You must excuse my tiny, confused brain in the heat of the moment, see, my upbringing wasn't the best. My mum, an alcoholic, my dad, a rapist and my 54 year old brother Fernando, a drugs and guns dealer. I was raised only knowing a life of crime, and to try and counteract following in my brother's footsteps. I chose to start a YouTube channel called Double Bubble. I tried to promote peace, self-belief and all the positive emotions one should feel every day for the whole duration of the day. In doing this, I felt fulfilled. But when I found out I said raping I could no longer take my existence on any further. So, my friends, family, and why pop dickheads? I have decided to kill myself in the worst way possible. Listening to Jacob Sartorius hit or miss on Rewind. Knowing that I have stopped my life of hate, I accept death and fully deserve my eternal torture in hell. Thanks you guys. Goodbye. It's just a prank bro. It's just a prank. Yeah so that was me when I was like 12. So um... I'm 17 now, um, so yeah, um, it's getting kind of close to my birthday as well, it's August, and my birthday's in, El in April, so I mean, it's it's not, it's not that far away, um, considering, that, um, you know, just considering the time, it's gone fucking quick this summer, which I'm fucking happy for, because uh, summer's just the time where it's just me sitting in my room doing fuck all, so it's, it's great. But yeah, um, I'm thinking of fucking doing this, I'm, tr I'm thinking of fucking coming full circle and actually finishing this fucking Dead Rising. Uh, I, it would have to be off the record though, because I, I, I made that one off the record, uh, which is a shame, because I, I definitely prefer Dead Rising 2. Uh, I'll, I'll see what happens when I get to it, um, but you know, it's fine. So this video is, um, is going to be about how to get good at zombies. Now, I've been playing a lot of zombies recently. As you can see, fucking auto shut down. Um, and I've noticed uh, there's quite a lot of shit people on zombies. Like, I mean, not shitty people, just shit people. You know, like, like round one and they die. Like, you know, like, not 
I mean, everyone's fucking done that, but, like, they just constantly go down every round. Like, for example, you know, Chris Smooth in this bit. Epic goes down every round, so whatever round we're on, that's how many downs Epic has. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. It's like that, you know. And, um, rest in peace, Call of Duty, Chris Smooth. So, I thought I might as well make a, uh, a list of how to get good at zombies. Um, of course, being me being me, it's not going to be an official list like, oh, go on to go on to the giant and train a little bit. Go on, go on to Shadows of Evil. Learn how to do pack a punch. Learn how the game works. No, it's not going to be any of that. This is basically just going to be one of my original videos in the form of a tutorial video. Okay, now the first tip into getting good at zombies is don't be shit okay I'll, i'm joking with that one yeah. so the first one this is legit don't be that guy now you, no one likes that guy you've you've probably heard it you know so for example if you play a lot of fifa because you're shit at zombies so you're good, good at fifa that's just how it works um so in fifa it would be the guy who constantly um like makes you watch their replays when they score um you know or they do the fucking thing where they pass in the ball and then they shoot and then they're of course going to score. Um, all that type of shit. Or when they're going to win and it's a close game and then they just pass it around their goalkeeper. Uh, that type of thing. No one likes that guy. Um, and there's this, there's a number of things in zombies that that guy could mean. So, for example, taking windows at the uh, start of the game. So taking windows is basically... You see how you have about four or five windows when you in every fucking starting every starting room there's at least three or four windows right they're usually because they're supposed to be allocated to one player um now although that was their intention or not that's basically just how people do that's how they do it now um now if you go around to these uh, um someone else's window uh and you steal their kills you're kind of a dickhead honestly because um no one likes that guy um, I mean, as soon as I see who that is, right, I, I just don't revive them, you know, and they're usually the person who fucking leaves when they get downed anyway, like, as soon as they get down, not, you know, not after they die out, and then they leave, you know, they, just, they, they go down, then they leave, it's just like, for fuck's sake, and then you're left with, like, a level 9 and a fucking level 4, so yeah, that's, that's one of don't be that guy, the other one is, uh, being a box whore, Especially during a fire sale. Now, a fire sale, because remember, you're a noob, you don't know these things. A fire sale is a pickup, a, a fucking a power up, if you will, uh, that you can get, and it will make everything in the box uh, only ten points. So people, some people take it upon themselves to hog the box uh, when they have the haymaker and a fucking dracon, or you know any of those guns that are pretty good. Uh, so don't be that guy. Especially if you see some of the fucking Shiva and Argus on fucking... I said Argus. That was just like... That's, that was just me not thinking there. It's a fucking Argus. Okay, so yeah. Shitty guns and you're just sitting there with like, you know, good guns. Don't, don't fucking hit the box. Don't be that guy. Okay, so first... This is the first tip. You know, this is the first tip. Right, this is the unofficial tip. Because it's tea time, that does not give you an excuse to leave, okay? Does your mum want you to do something for her, fuck off, you're playing zombies, right, I've already told my mum, if I'm playing zombies, I can't do anything, right, she doesn't ask me for a lot, which is fucking fantastic, actually, but when she asks me, and I'm playing zombies, I say, I can't, because I'm playing zombies, that's like a, a known thing in our house, my brother knows it, if you're playing zombies, you fucking do it instead, because your mum wants you to do something, don't make me fucking hold a zombie for like five or ten minutes until you get back. Okay, because that's just, that's just stupid. And that goes for anyone. If, if you're that guy who says, Oh, i got to have my tea now. Um, just hold a zombie. No. No, they, your friends should let you die out. Because they're, they're just the worst type of people. You know, because when you get into a zombies game, those people are your family for the whole fucking duration of the game. If they fucking go and hang out with their fucking other family because they got to fucking eat or take out the fucking dog or, you know, fucking do any other fucking chores, they're, they're just... They're, they're fucking rusing against you, they're plotting against you, just fucking make them, just kill them, because they're, they're not worth it. So here's your first legit, legit fucking thing, right? So get Jug first. 
That's that's that must be like a thing that all of you know, but you know, some people don't understand that. You could be on fucking round fifteen and you might not even have a jug yet. I mean, you know, zombie pros like me, uh, you know, getting jug at round fifteen, that's fine. But when you're shit and you constantly go down, you need to get jug. And then of course if you're playing co op and you're a team player, you know you are a team player, you have to be a team player, right? You get you get quick revive. So uh this one is coming to um I kind of mentioned it a little bit. Uh, don't leave just because you got downed. Now there are a number of things that can help you get revived. Um for one being a little crybaby and leaving isn't gonna be one of them, okay? Uh you need to either just sit there and hope and pray to God that the level 1 that just got zombies and just put Black Ops 3 into his PS4 uh, actually tries and revives you. Um, he probably has some type of zombie fucking knowledge. Um, if not, then you're just dead, basically. Um, someone could have also had Phoenix up, which is a gobble gum. That, um, you know, just you pop it and then everyone everyone gets revived. So it's great. Um, or they could just come and revive you and clutch the fuck out of it. Um, especially if they have a shield. If they have a shield, then they're not, they're not going to give a fuck. You know, I've done that, just fucking, you get a shield and then there you go. You, you're basically invincible at that point. Especially if you're on Gorg Crofty, because that shield is just OP as fuck. Yeah, don't, don't leave. Don't, don't leave, because you're, you're a dickhead. Okay. So, uh, counteracting this, the only times when you can leave is if you're lagging like a motherfucker, because no one likes that guy who lags a lot, and then they just constantly, they just constantly go down, okay? So, I've done this, you know, I've done this multiple times because my connection is shit. Uh, you know, if I'm just lagging, then I'll just leave, and then I'll send a message to fucking, to people, you know, like in the game, like, oh, I was lagging, because I'm that type of guy, I'm that type of guy. Uh, and I think that's the only time that you actually have good time. Like I said, you, your dad's telling you to get off your Xbox or your PlayStation, right? Or if you're a rich kid, your PC. Because, you know, Black Ops 3 is quite a good looking game. You probably have to have a good PC for, to run it. Um, then, no, tell them to fuck off. Because, you know, you, you're trying to do this, okay? You're, you're trying to fucking be the best. Alright, so last one. Last one. Is, uh, respects your teammates, okay? Now, what I mean by this is, if you see someone training in your spot, say, this, this, this goes for everyone, okay? So, for example, on the Eisendrak, right, one of the dragon heads, I usually like to run around it. You know the one where, like, you can do the fucking disco ball thing? I like to run around that bit. That's a pretty good training spot. If someone's already there, I'm not gonna fucking sit there and fuck us both, okay? I'm gonna either train somewhere else, or I'll train just outside the fucking the room. Because that that's just how you do it. So if someone's if someone's there, and you did a training in your spot, don't fucking try and train because you're just gonna fuck each other over. And also, uh, just real quick tip: if you're fucking camping on a catwalk at round seven on a giant, then I mean, God help you because I mean that would just be a really boring game, and that's why I've chosen not to not to fucking camp on this game because I got the wonder woofy, so it, probably not. Um, I can't think of any other tips, and I think I've got to the end of this one. Um, so if you want to get more um, more technical, if you're playing and someone says in public match, um, do you want to do the Easter egg? Just leave, because no one likes to do fucking, you know, like... And if you're that guy, why are you... F it's fucking, it's it's fucking co-op. Like, everyone plays co-op. Why do you want to do the fucking Easter egg? In, in fucking in in co-op with randoms you know it's just like it's just shit um so yeah i think that was it um i originally wanted to make this fucking channel um like just zombies but uh considering none of the maps record except from the giant and i literally refuse to get a fucking elgato um i hate the fucking way it says because like like americans go elgato and then, like, what the fuck? I don't want to fucking sound like a retard and say El Gato or El Gato. You know, because, like, a fucking Gato is something you eat. You know, like a chocolate one there, they're pretty nice. Um, so I don't know. Um, I, I refuse to get a capture card at this point in time because, I mean, <laughs> two views of video, I mean, I'm not exactly fucking PewDiePie. So I, I can't, and I don't have a job. 
Like, I'm one of those guys who, like, if I don't like the fucking job, I'm not going to do it. So, um, I'm one of those people. So, um, then that was it. Um, if it helped you in any way, then thanks. If it didn't, then, I mean, well, fuck you. Um, I, I, it probably wouldn't help me either, but uh, it's fine. So maybe I'll make a legit one. Actually, that's a good idea. So after this one, is going to be a fucking legit one. Because, uh, you know, I'm quite the zombies pro um, when it comes to experience. Not that I'm, like, high rounds and all that type of shit. So, yeah. Thank you for watching. And, um... Please like, subscribe. No, I hate people that say that.